Shalom friends, welcome to DOF Reactions SOTA 20. In today's DOF, we discover something shocking, and that is that there is a functionality issue with the SOTA ritual. Turns out it was the Theranos of antiquity. I'm truly flabbergasted who could have predicted such a thing. If a woman has Torah learning to her merit, she could have a delayed reaction, like delayed up to three years. Really kind of defeats the purpose of having the test to begin with. Ben Azai would like to say something. A person has to teach his daughter Torah. Wow, amazing comment, you might be thinking. How inspiring to find a sage so supportive of Torah learning for women way ahead of his time. Just kidding. Because unfortunately, he kept talking. Yeah, teach her Torah so if she goes through the Sota ritual and doesn't become a decomposing banana peel immediately, she will know it's not because she's innocent. No, no, no. Um, it's because she's temporarily wrapped in the bubble wrap of Torah. The saran wrap of Torah? Benazai, you were so close, but you fumbled it. Honestly, I can't take you seriously anyway because you had to go ask Metatron how babies are made. Go sit down. Up next is Rabbi Eliezer who has something also trash to say. And it is, anyone who teaches his daughter Torah is teaching her to be promiscuous. Apparently, once women know that the merit of Torah learning acts as protection, obviously women are going to use this knowledge as a metaphorical condom, if you will, to guard against the Sota ritual. It is also possible that what Rabbi Eliezer meant is that women are mentally incapable of understanding Torah, and therefore it's a waste of time to teach a woman Torah. Dude, do you think we're too smart or not smart enough? Pick a lane. Now, fun fact, I actually have a personal vendetta with Rabbi Eliezer because that statement of his, well, when I started this series, that got quoted at me rather a lot. So I really hate to tell him this from the future. I'm so sorry to have to do this. Just kidding, I'm delighted to do it. Honey, you get excommunicated because nobody liked you. You had to appeal to inanimate objects to agree with you because nobody else did. Maybe that's why you didn't want women learning because then the other 50% of the Jewish community would be talking shit about you behind your back. I mean, it's certainly what I do. Considering how many women learn now, I really hope you're getting an aerobic workout spinning in your grave so fast. 